right, let's get this out there first. Let's just drive this over there. Keep it hooked up. That way we don't set off an alarm and oh dear. YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Teardown, and yes folks, we are back once again, and today, we are ready to commit more crimes. Now, I know that sounds odd, I thought this was some sort of just physics destruction game, but it turns out, you're actually a criminal, which is great. So, if we go over to our computer here, we've already completed a couple missions, which by the way, if you missed the first episode, I'll have a playlist in the description. So, let's get on here and see what we've got. So, we have a new job here, it's from Gordon Wu? Uh, thanks for helping me out with that building, which by the way, we've been uh, stealing stuff from some sort of chemical plant. But it appears that we're gonna go do something with a yacht. Huh. So we're gonna use our demolition skills and remove one of the timeshare cabins. So yeah, I guess we're gonna go in and destroy some stuff, so let's go make some space. Alright, so making space. So I had to go through it again, but it appears that we're destroying a cabin in order to get this guy's yacht in. And, uh, we've got to dump some safes. That's kind of sketchy sounding. So we have a primary target of an office safe and an outermost cabin, which is this here. And our escape vehicle's here. I guess as long as the police don't show up, we're good. So I'm assuming they're putting in the new dock here uh, for the yacht. Now this is fine. So, hmm, how do we want to destroy this building? I mean, there's a ton of different ways. I'm thinking we just drive a box truck through it because that's amazing. Also, by the way, if you want to see more teardown on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button and helps out my channel. And let's destroy this building. All right, here we go. And oh yes. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, oh, uh oh, uh, we're kind of stuck. This is fine. We just made a new entrance. All right, let's go find this safe real quick. And ooh, we've got some valuables in here. So we're gonna rob this place. Uh, search for anything of value. Oh, let's go upstairs. I think the safe's up here. Can we just grab it, or are we gonna have to, like, tow it out? Uh, let's see. Oh, it's in the next room. I love the destruction in this game. It's absolutely incredible. All right, so here's the safe. All right, so this is a target. Oh, we can't pick this up. We're gonna have to haul this out. All right, we're gonna need to find something. Is there only one safe? I think that's it. Okay, well, I guess before we demolish the building completely, hold on, let's go out the front door. I guess we should have done this in the first place. It's fine. Do we have something we can take the safe out with? Ooh, bingo. There's something across over there. I think it's a forklift. All right, so we have a new tool in our arsenal, and it's a blowtorch. So we can actually cut metal. So we're just going to cut a hole in this fence real quick, and we're totally just going to go in and steal some of the construction equipment. Look at that. All right, so, oh, there's a crane here. We probably could use that to get the safe, or we could use the forklift. You know what? The crane sounds a little bit smarter, so uh, let's just drive through here. This is fine. <laughs> just destroyed the front end of it. Okay, so what we want to do, we want to make a hole in the wall where the uh, safe is, and we'll come and uh, grab it with the crane, and we'll dump it in the water, and then we'll blow up the building. Uh, well, I don't know if we're going to blow it up. I mean, I kind of hope we're going to. By the way, that little grill area, that looks like it'd be fun to destroy too. But we already have our target, it's fine. You know, out of curiosity, since the safe is metal, can we can we blow torch it open? Oh, I don't think we can. I was hoping we can maybe get it open and see if there's some money. Alright, so let's see. Oh, there is no brick on this, so we can uh, make a hole in the wall with the sledgehammer. Hey, we're gonna break out the, uh, the roof a little bit, make way for the crane. Perfect! Yeah, this will work. Knock a little bit of that back. There we go. There's gonna be no resistance here. All right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oops. Uh, ooh. Thought that was gonna go through the floor there. I guess that could have been an option too. Oh, I gotta get out. There we go. All right. So let's see if we can grab this with the crane real quick. So we're gonna come over here and let's go. Oh. Okay. Uh. Move the arm. Okay. Move it that way. Uh, we need to be able to hook this, so let's go down. Okay, the crane controls, a little questionable. Hold on, I'm getting used to this. Uh, trying to hook it. Come on. Come on. No, we hooked the wrong piece. Did I just get it? Nope. 
All right, this is going to take a couple of attempts here, I think. All right, back it up. And I can't tell. Are we on it right now? All right, we're on it. There we go. Look at that. Look how nifty this game is. This is amazing. You know, I just realized we don't have to completely destroy this building. Our actual building targets are on the other side. It just wants the safe. So I'm assuming we just dump this safe in the water. Also, by the way, I was trying to figure out why we have an extinguisher. Apparently, large fires set alarms off and I guess the police come. So we can't do that. So yeah, let's go dump the safe. By the way, apparently there's another safe that we can get to. It's a secondary target, so it's optional. I'm going to go look at it. We might go ahead and take care of it. Maybe we'll get paid a little bit extra here. Okay, so we need to take out a cabin. Uh, the outermost cabin. So this is where the, uh, the yacht's going to go. Can we drive the boats? Like, I feel like we could just crash this into here. Hold on. Eh? Please tell me we can drive this. Oh, we can. Oh, we're about to send a boat into a cabin. This is going to be amazing. All right. Say goodbye to the cabin. Here we go. And... Oh, oh that's so cool. All right. If we separate the supports here, this should drop it off into the uh, ocean. Yep, this is fine. We're just destroying somebody's property. Oh, there it goes. Oh, no. It stopped. Hold on. Just back it up. We're good. There we go. Destroy this support. And uh oh, it's taking the boat down. Okay. On, get out. Get out. Okay. Uh, does that count? That was amazing looking. Like the destruction physics in this game. Oh, there's something else. Okay, it's still a little too tall here. On, break it off. Let's get it down into the water here. There it goes. All right, it's still connected by the uh, electrical stuff here. Uh, we might need to take care of that real quick. Uh, here. Knock that down. There we go. And I need to knock a hole in that over there. Hold on. Let's go up here and separate the cord. There it goes. All right. It's down in the ocean. All right. We need to drive to the other side real quick. And we need to take care of the uh, the other safe. All right. Where's this safe at? It's in here somewhere. It's over here to the left. Uh, is the door open? Uh, let's not use the fire. Let's go ahead and just knock this down. Dang. This is another big safe. All right, let's knock it into the uh, the floor below us, and we'll use the forklift to get it out. There we go, and boom. There it goes. Oh, hopefully that's not explosive. All right, so we have our forklift here. Let's go ahead and put the forks down. Uh, can we lift this? Oh, on forks up. Okay, this is fine. I mean, really, we could just push it off in the ocean, and I think that'll work. Yeah, it's... Kind of a little wide for the forks, or a little uh, skinny, I should say. Uh, let's try sitting off the back here. Come on. Drop it down. Oh, uh, man, this thing's hard to move. Okay, folks, I've managed to break three vehicles and spent about 30 minutes trying to move this safe. I feel like if I would have taken the crane over here, we totally would have got this done a lot quicker. Yeah. My bad. Okay. Uh, I might still be able to get the crane over here, though. Folks, we got a bit of an issue. Uh, so where I parked the crane, I can't get back up. They don't have a ramp here. And, uh-oh. I feel like the dock is breaking below us. Folks, I don't think we're getting this second safe. I should probably... Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Go forward. Okay, come on. Hop it up. Wait, can I use the arm to pick myself up? I can't. I am totally screwed. Ha. Huh. Oh, well, this kind of shows you guys how your destruction and where you place vehicles, this could totally affect the, the later part of the level. So, you know what? We're gonna, we're dumping this. There we go. All right, let's just leave. You know what? I, I want to get that second safe. I can always go back and do the level again and get it, but I don't think it's worth it. All right, let's get out of here. I'm pretty sure we'll be back. Okay, well, I, uh, I spawned back. It seems to be raining, and am I trying to fix my roof? Oops. Uh, is this my roof? I think this is my roof. I don't think I'm supposed to do this. All right, so... Hmm. I wonder, are we ever going to upgrade the building here? I mean, we're making decent money, I would assume, now. Uh, let's go ahead and pop open this bad boy here. There we go. And let's see. Uh, what's the news got to say about us? Anything? Uh, oh. Wait, what are we watching? Wait. Rumors of a ghost in a cabin. Was that the marine cabin? Was that the marina? I think it was. I kind of want to go back there to the marina and go check out the cabin with the ghost in it. Huh. 
Oh, let's go see if we got some messages. Oh, Classic Cars by Gordon Wu. So we're doing some more jobs for him. Uh, he's happy with the, uh, the Merino work. Another thing came up. There was a Classic Car auction up in Black River the other day, and one guy just kept overbidding me. Oh, no. So, yeah, apparently it's some youngster outbid him on cars. Are we stealing them? Are we breaking them? Like, I'm hoping we'll break them. Oh, can you help me acquire these two gems? I'll take good care of them. So we're going to go in and steal cars. This is fine. All right, let's go back to the marina. All right, classic cars. What do we got to do here? Uh, let's see. We have documents in the office and spare parts in the warehouse. That should be easy to get. So we have a car. Oh, one of the cars is on the ship. Oh, man. And then the other car is in a warehouse. Where do we take the cars to? There are wired box alarms in this level. Okay, so we don't want to set off security. We got to get these cars. We'll go for the cars last. I think we're going to go for the documents first, which I think they're in here. So we broke into this place. I'm pretty sure they've upgraded their security. So hopefully they don't have any sort of uh, those little sensors that sense the breaking glass. There we go. All right, looking for some documents. Uh, they're going to be here in the office. That's a bathroom. That's another bathroom. Probably upstairs. Uh, let's see. Ah, here oh, you gotta be kidding me. Who hooks up their stuff to an alarm like this? Okay, so we'll have to come for this last. Uh, it's noted, though. Let's make an escape point for it. There we go. Alright, that works. So, yeah, we'll come up here, we'll grab those last, and we'll escape. So, let's go see the other targets real quick. You know, I wonder if there's a tool like a wire cutter, or would a blowtorch work if we blowtorch the wire? I kind of want to try that. I feel like that might actually work. Hold on. Now that I'm thinking about it, like, you're supposed to come up with clever ways to uh, defeat these puzzles. What if we just blowtorch the wire? By the way, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know I haven't watched footage of this like of other YouTubers because I wanted to save it. So yeah, we're about to try this. All right, here we go. I got a quick save in. Let's go. Okay, we cannot cut the... Uh-oh. Uh, uh, oh, I, we might want to get the extinguisher. Okay, so that is not a thing. I mean, it was worth the try. Okay, let's uh, let's go to the next target. Okay, so we've got to drive the, uh, the cars up into a truck. I just realized that we have a, a huge truck over there in trailer. So, we've got this. Do you guys have alarms on the gates? Oh, the gates just open right up. I like that. So I think we're going to put those big forklift, uh, or at least one of the big forklifts into use, maybe with the boat one. But I think this car over here might be the easy one to get. By the way, it's it's daylight. Like, is nobody working? I don't know. It's kind of strange. All right, let's just bust through this one. Boom! There we go. And let's get access to the door here. Oh, there's uh, something in, in here. Is that the spare parts? Oh, we might need to break in here. Let's go. Boom. Oh, yeah. They've got some uh, pretty sturdy doors here, don't they? Oh, they're not locked. You got to be kidding me. And is this thing wired? You got to be kidding me. This one's wired, too. How do you how do you do this? All right. Maybe we're driving the whole thing over. By the way, let me go get whatever is up here. There's something of value in one of these offices. Uh, maybe this one. Oh, uh, no, it's the next one. Or if this is the spare parts I'm supposed to grab. I want to open that. Uh, you got to be kidding me. This is everything's hooked up to some sort of a, a security system. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, let's get this out there first. Let's just drive this over there. Keep it hooked up. That way we don't set off an alarm. And oh dear. Okay, let's hope the car doesn't fall off. This is fine. Uh, we're doing some sort of janky vehicle heist right now. All right, let's get this thing ready to be loaded. So let's put the bed down. So all we got to do is unhook it and back it into it. There we go. All right, so that's ready to go. That's cool looking. All right, let's go look at that boat real quick and see how that car is hooked up. Oh, really? This thing shuts on me? All right, you know what? Let's just make a permanent hole here. If I cut this little connection in the gate, does it open up? I don't know. Does it swing open? No, I think I need to make myself a hole here. So let's go. Uh. There we go. I like doing this. This is uh, oddly addicting. All right, let's go check out the other one. All right, what are we dealing with out here on this big boat? Uh, I'm hoping it's not hooked up too because 
Yeah. Oh, it's just in one of these crates. Oh, I see a red dot. Yeah, there's definitely alarm on this one, too. But we can get the crane over here and we can, uh, I think, take the whole thing off the boat. Uh, wait, do we have to use one of these big cranes? Wait, can we just drive the boat? Oh, please tell me we can drive the boat. That would be so... Oh, we can. So what we're going to do, there's a big crane back here along the uh, along the shore. Like, I don't like the, the normal crane's going to be able to lift this, but this behemoth of a thing is definitely going to be able to lift it. Uh, hold on, let's go here. And... Wait. We could totally just drive it off of the boat, boat dock. Does that sound good? I don't know. Here, let's try taking the whole thing. Do we have a flatbed? We could maybe take it off that. All right. Please tell me we can drive this. Like, I'm, I'm almost 100% sure we can operate this thing. Uh, all right. Nope. No, don't spray paint it. There we go. Does this work? Wait, you gotta be kidding me. This thing doesn't actually work? That doesn't seem right. Like, I totally thought that's what they were setting us up for. I guess they do want us to use the crane. Oh boy. Okay, so maybe we can't do the optional objectives yet. Like, I don't think we're gonna have enough time because everything's attached to an alarm. So I don't think that's a thing. All right, so we parked this on the shore. So we're ready to drive the boat off, or uh, the car off, I should say. And yeah, we could totally get it to the thing. I wonder if it's gonna be 30 seconds or what the timer's gonna be like. Uh, here, let's make a hole here and make sure this gate's open. And then we'll set off the alarms and see if we have enough time. But there's gotta be a way to defeat the alarms. I just gotta figure that out. Maybe you get a tool later on because I don't think we have enough time to do anything. All right, let's just park that there. All right. Oh, the gate's trying to close on. Hey, hey, don't do that. Don't. I guess it's gonna open up regardless, so we're probably fine. All right, we're uh, we're ready to try to make a run at this. Okay, so we're gonna get into here. So if I yeet this and yank it off. All right, there it goes. All right, so we got a minute on this one, so that's actually not that bad. All right, so that's one car there. Uh, man, we would almost have time to go grab some documents or something. Uh, but we have just enough time to at least get the cars. So that makes sense. So hold on, let's see how smooth this one goes. Okay, get this one, drive it off. There we go. Uh, all right, we got about 30, a little over 30 seconds. All right, on, don't damage this. All right, pull this around to here. Oh, geez. Yeah, I don't think we have enough time to go get the documents. Uh, we have a hole up there, but, uh, you know what? We're going to call it here. And then if you guys have any suggestions or know how to get this, uh, or get these alarms taken care of, let me know down in the comment section below. Let's go ahead and escape here. And uh, at least we got the two primary targets. All right, looks like we have a new tool. Let me guess, this tool takes care of the alarms. Oh, uh, let's go get the tool real quick. All right, what's our new tool? This looks like a gun. Wait, why do we have a shotgun? Wait, why do I feel like we can shoot maybe the alarms? Is that a thing? Oh, uh, it seems dangerous to give us a gun. By the way, we can upgrade some tools too. So we can go to tools. Uh, so sledge, we can't upgrade that one. None of these, maybe the, oh, here we go. We can upgrade the fuel for the blowtorch and the shotgun, we can upgrade it. We've got a lot of money here. So let's go and upgrade the fuel. I feel like we never have enough of that. And then let's upgrade the damage and maybe the rounds for the shotgun. There we go. But anyways, I think it's gonna wrap it up for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, we'll return with some more here really soon. And we'll see you guys next time.